Tonight, it's time for another Time Cheater meal. And what are we making tonight? We're gonna to be making pigs in blankets. I've got eight hot dogs, and I also have a can of crescent rolls. There are eight in this can, and I have eight hot dogs. So, those are the ingredients, so let's get started. And we'll just get our little crescent rolls open here. And I'm just going to give it a little whack on the table. And there we go. Just pops open like that. And we'll just get this open right up. And there's nothing fancy about this meal. This is one of my time cheater meals because these are for nights where you just don't have time to make a, you know, a real meal from scratch. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to open all of these up. And we'll just separate them here. There we go. Right along the middle. And then what we're going to do, just grab your wiener. And we'll just roll it right up. Just like that and just roll it right up. Just like that. So I'll just whip through these and I'll come back when I'm done. All right, and our last one. And this is a really, really fast, yummy dinner when you just don't have time to you know, make a real dinner. So here we have our little wieners. So I'm gonna grab a tray and I'll be back in a second. All right, got my tray. And what we're gonna do, just gonna get all of our wieners down on our tray. There we go. And let's just place them. They are gonna expand a little bit, so try to leave a little room for them to expand. And I'm going to bake these 375 degrees Fahrenheit. You want them to be golden brown. And in case you're wondering, yes, these hot dogs are raw, but in that amount of time, these hot dogs will fully cook. So it's very, very safe. So into the oven and I'll see you in a bit. All right, here they are, right out of the oven. These are my pigs in blankets. I baked them for a total of 14 minutes at 375 degrees Fahrenheit. So, let's open one up and check them out. Okay, let's cut into this. I'll just show you the inside. And there we go. So this is another video in my Time Cheater meal series. And so that's it for this video. I'll see you next time.